Hey guys, welcome back to my channel again. So in today's video, I will be taking you with me. We're going to be cleaning my couch. We're going to do a couch cleaning routine. I will be sharing with you guys how I do my spot cleaning and I don't use any chemicals. I only use one product and it is like magic literally like it's magic but uh disclaimer before we go into the video i am not a professional cleaner i am just a mom who try new things and i just tried this one method and for my couch i have a fabric couch from living spaces and it works for me i don't know if it's gonna work on your couch i've never tried it on any other couch like um what do you call that hmm microfiber couch <laughs> that i don't know if it's gonna work on that because those couches like the microfiber couches are very hard to clean that's why i didn't get those type of material so for me it works on my couch so i just want to tell you guys that because i don't want you guys coming back to me saying things like oh it didn't work on me or my couch is ruined because of your method or whatever it is you know so now that disclaimer is out there now yeah so that's what we're gonna be doing today we're gonna be doing some spot cleaning of my couches there's a lot of stains and we're also gonna style my couch I purchased this stuff from Amazon and Walmart so I will be sharing that with you guys also later on in this video and I think that's about it so yeah if you guys want to see that then just keep on watching okay guys so welcome back again and excuse the mess it's really messy because i have kids and it's unavoidable so i will be sharing with you guys how i do my spot cleaning i will show you the spots that i'm talking about the stains that i'm talking about so like for example like this one right here that one this one i believe that's um ice cream and like this one where my daughter loves to put her mouth and wipe her mouth on <laughs> this area right here for some reason she loves that area but those are the type of um, stains that I'm talking about so those are the things that we're gonna be spot cleaning today and we're also gonna be taking out the couch and we're gonna vacuum the inside because I haven't vacuumed them in like weeks already and we're gonna just do the spot cleaning so yeah so I will be sharing with you guys how I take out those spots in a little bit so for now I just want to show you guys the things that I purchased for my couch so we can style it together so first off I went on Amazon so instead of buying a new set of pillows, I bought some pillow covers instead because it's a lot cheaper. So I went on Amazon and I picked this up from Amazon. I love the style, the color is just, I love it. I love the neutral colors. I love uh, the dark brown color, like a burnt brown color or like a teal color or a mustard color. So that's like my favorite. But I will share that with you guys in a little bit. So first, I purchased six 18 by 18 um, pillow covers from Amazon. And this is how they look like. They're so cute, right? Look at this. It's just so pretty. It's just so nice and neutral. And I love them. And there's one more thing that I want to show you guys that I really love from Amazon and it's a lot a little bit cheaper than what I got because this one that I got is from Folky, and it's uh, $47.97 it was um, the original price was $60 but it went down there on sale right now so that's why it's $47.97 but there's other thing that I really like and it's from El Folkly as well and from Huff 
home finer I can't talk but they're the $40 and they're similar to what I got and it's just so cute um, maybe in the future I will get this but for now I stick to that I'm gonna stick for this to this one for a minute and yeah I just love these kind of style this is like uh, my style for some reason I am just loving neutral colors so yeah that one th these two that I'm showing you guys are $40 so if you guys want to um, check that out I will leave the link in the description down below so I also went at Walmart to get some pillows just for an extra touch of different color a pop of color you know just to mix it up a little bit and so I got this one i don't know if you guys can see, yeah you guys can see that right and it's reversible and it just gives it a nice mixture of color with the black or navy i believe this is like a navy color or black and the brown so they kind of like match and i also got this one from walmart it came up it came with like two so it just gives it a pop of color you know and so this one was $14 I believe and this one as well was $14 so yeah so that's what I got for my couch and we're gonna style it together and yeah so right now let's just go jump right into spot cleaning my couch and I'll show you guys my method and then after that we're just gonna clean it out and we're gonna style it together okay so let's just go jump right in and before i continue actually um if you guys like this videos please don't forget to give it a like and consider subscribing to your girl it helps the channel a lot so yeah let's just go jump right into the video okay guys so are you excited to know my method i use a magic eraser yes it is a magic and it really works for my couch i haven't tried it again i'm gonna tell you again i haven't tried it in any other couch but guys i don't know i just one time i just had a stain and the couch was really brand new and i'm like oh my gosh what am i gonna do so and i tried using the magic eraser in this house my first time as well using magic eraser so i was like mm, why wouldn't i just like you know try the magic eraser maybe it'll work and it is it's magic to me and it really does work and so i just put like a water and i just dip this and i will take you guys with me and let's go clean some stains on my couch and i will show you guys once it's dry like it just it's just like it's magic okay so yeah let's go okay guys so we are back and let's go clean some stains like for example this one right here i would just uh, do this rub it a little bit not too hard because you don't want to mess up the fabric so that's what I do until I see that it's clearing out and like that and I just leave it like that for a minute and let's go clean this one big one right here and You see how it's like mm, taking it out really good? It is magic. You see how it's clearing up? So I will continue on and we're gonna take this one out as well. And yeah, I'm just gonna clean the spots and I'll show you guys later on the results, okay? Okay guys, so I just finished doing the spot cleaning and my couch looks like a Dalmatians now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. There's a lot of um, wet spots and I will show you guys the results once it gets dry. But right now they're all wet 
and let's just go continue cleaning and vacuuming the couch as long as I'm safely in your arms And it don't really matter where we stay Don't pass, babe Space makes me sad Cause So, hey guys, I just want to share something that I learned this past Sunday from our church. Um, I just want to share this with you guys because most of us get very busy at home or whatever we do in life is just sometimes gets chaotic and too busy especially if you have kids um just life in general is just a busy life you know so i just want to come on here and share you with you guys what i learned this past sunday that prayer doesn't help our relationship with god prayer is our relationship with god so what we learned was that we have to make time for god for our creator to be alone with him to have that moment of silence and peace so i know not everyone can have that quiet moment i for me i still have a hard time having my own quiet time with god so i just want to encourage um each and every one of us to leave a comment down below to what you guys want us to pray for you so let's create a chain of prayer for each and every one of us because we need the prayers and encouragement in life let's pray for healing for strength for patience whatever it is that you guys need us to pray for you leave it down in the comments below and we will pray for you that way we change all of my pillows I'm loving it a lot and if you guys like this cover I will leave the link in the description below but now let's go jump right into styling my couch
here's how the couch styling turned out I love it um, but at the same time I'm kind of debating on switching the pillows the teal the teal pillows again to just a neutral colors and changing the uh, throw blankets as well with just new colors um, I don't know I think in the future that's what I'm gonna do but for now we're just gonna stick on how this couch is looking and there's still a lot of things that I want to do in our living room so stay tuned for that because we still have a lot to do like the painting and decorating So, okay guys, let's go look at the uh, stains that I was showing you guys earlier. So, as you can see, it's still a little wet, but there's no more stains. And the chocolate that was here, it's gone as well. And this one is still a little uh, wet, but all of them are finally gone. And clean there's no more stains I just love it so this is how I clean my couch how I spot um, clean the stains as you can see it's still a little wet right there as well but there's no more stains on the couch and it's really like a magic that's why they call it magic razor <laughs> but it's so nice and clean so we just had to maintain the cleanliness of this couch so there you have it guys I am sweaty and I look nasty right now but that's how my couch cleaning routine looks like and that's how I do my spot cleaning for my couch I just use one thing and that is it and it works for me I don't know if it's gonna work on your couch so yeah that is it guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this is how I styled my couch um, let me know if you guys like it and for sure in a couple of days I know it's gonna change but for now this is how the couch is looking so yeah if you guys like this kind of video please don't forget to give it a like and consider subscribing to your girl it helps the channel a lot and I will see you guys in the next video bye bye